Oh, hi. Welcome to the tutorial. Here, I'll teach you everything you'll need to know about how to play my game. To move around, you'll need to use the move and look buttons. You can see them on the chalkboards behind me. In this tutorial, all the buttons you'll need to press will be shown on these chalkboards, so be sure to read them. Hold the run button while you move. Just make sure you don't run out of stamina. With the elite trick. You can interact with all sorts of things around my super schoolhouse. If you want to interact with something, all you have to do is look at it and press the action button. Why don't you try it right now by opening this door? Oh, I heard that. When you do things that make noises, I'll hear them and I'll use those noises to find you. When we're playing hide and seek, you'll have to try to be quiet if you want to win. Walk into the next room to continue the tutorial. The goal of my game is to find all the notebooks in each level. You'll find notebooks in classrooms like this one. To collect a notebook, just look at it and press the action button. To continue, Grab that notebook, and then step into the next room. Some notebooks are locked behind tricky activities, such as this one, my math machine. If you want to get these notebooks, you'll have to solve the activity first. To complete this activity, first you'll need to solve the math problem displayed on the front of the machine. Then you'll need to use the action button to pick up the balloon in the shape of the correct number and put it in the math machine. Once you submit an answer, the notebook will appear. Try it out. Uh-oh. Looks like you got that problem wrong. Don't worry, you can still get the notebook. But when you're playing my game, getting problems wrong will make it harder. While you're exploring my super schoolhouse, you'll find all sorts of useful items. To pick up an item, just look at it and press the action button. Then it will be added to your inventory. To use an item, select it with the item selection buttons, and when it's highlighted, press the use item button. It's that easy! Every item does something different, so let's try a few. 
Grab this quarter and use it on the vending machine to get a soda. Whoa! Did you see that? Sodas can push stuff around. Every item does something different, so be sure to learn what they all do. Go into the next room to continue the tutorial. I think the button is at the end of this maze. Good thing you have a map. Your map automatically fills out as you explore, so you won't get lost in there. Press and hold the quick map button to quickly view a map of the surrounding area. Press the advanced map button to view the entire map on your You Can Think pad. There. You can zoom in and out, scroll around, and place markers to keep track of cool stuff. It's pretty cool. Go on. I'm sure you can find that button. the button, and then hop into this vent. It's a little shortcut I built.